Hello there! Uh, welcome back for the minifigures review video and this video we're gonna take a look at this uh, Vulture minifigure. Uh, this is by the brand uh, uh, AF or AK, right? Uh, some sort, right? So there's another brand that's also releasing a similar um, a Vulture minifigure that's by DT. So we're gonna take a look at that when once I receive it. Uh, but for now, let's check out this awesome minifigure here. Okay, so um, previously we do have a Vulture based on the Spider-Man movie, so this is the one. Um, I kind of like this one at that moment. Um, this was actually released by Sin, so, but the thing is that you have to build the entire rings and uh, it looks kind of too big, right, clunky. But I did have fun playing with this. So now we're looking at this, a fully sculpted wings. Uh, this minifigure here is awesome and it doesn't really price at, at that high range, alright? You can see, um, okay, let's check out the wings here. Excellent details in terms of the wings, you can see. Uh, beautiful color separations, right? You can see even uh, this backpack here. Okay, you can see some weathering or some seam lines uh, covering there. Very nice detail, alright? Okay, so yeah, I don't wear the start, right? So let's start with the wings here. So wings, you do have two layers, okay? So there's one, you can actually flap to the front, and this you can actually pull to the back. Um, now, initially, it's kind of difficult to move to the back. You have to adjust it once you're able to pull it back, then you can do it easily, All right? So you can see, and same goes for this side here, okay? So it's beautiful. You can do all these things, and this is the second layer of the wings here. Okay, it has this uh, kind of like a fan or uh, turbine. Okay, and these things you can actually rotate it. Okay, so uh, very detailed. All right, you can see here. Beautiful. So same for the other side of the wings. So it's very poseable in terms of the wings. You can actually pull it out both this way, or you can have it. You know, covering uh, vulture. It's it's really fun. It's really fun to play with. Okay, so uh, that's the wing part, and just look at the this the helmet. And the helmet is beautiful. You have this. It's a separate piece. You have to uh, attach to it. Okay, it's a transparent piece. A very nice design. Okay, and you can see the whole helmet. It's a very good helmet there. Okay, it's a lot of details. I mean, uh, it's beautiful stuff. Don't know what to say. It's just amazing. Okay, so the face painting is okay. Uh, it does look, look like a, a bit like Michael Keaton, right? There's no uh, double sided face print, so you just remove this, and this is the uh, uh, the neck piece here. Come on, focus. Okay, so you can see the neck. neck piece is okay. Um, I find the details a little bit soft, but still uh, very good. Okay, so here you can see that's how the wings look like. So basically, you do need this to, to actually hang on, have the entire thing uh, you know attached to the minifigure. All right? You can see there's a pack here that packs into it. All right. So here you do have the, uh, the pieces of the arm here. It's very nice solid metal color. Oh, the head keeps on rolling off. Okay, very shiny metallic silver. And uh, you can see the leg part here. This is very nice. The claws here, you can actually, it's maneuverable. So basically you can just, you know, uh, have him like uh, catch someone with the uh, with the claws and just fly around with it. It's beautiful. Okay, you can do that, right? So these two parts here, you have to uh, attach it, assemble it on your own. Okay, and you can see the side of the leg here. Just just a lot of great details. All right. So of course you can remove it. Well, let's try to get this out there. Okay. Uh, body printing is okay. I mean, the main thing about this minifigure is not really on the body printing, uh, but still, it's decent. You can see here. Okay, you do get a uh, quite a good detail. 
So overall, um, beautiful minifigure, very fun to play with. Uh, I haven't actually played with a minifigure for quite some time, and this is one of them <laughs> that uh, after I assembled with it, uh, I just kind of pulls it uh, off and on because of the wings. Uh, you can do a lot with the wings. Okay. Really love this one. I think this is the best Vulture minifigure as of now. A uh, great job by uh, by this brand AK. Um, there is the DT brand. Um, the wings looks a little bit different, but it's also sculpted. Now we're gonna look at that and see how good is that as well. Now you can see here you have to be very careful when you try to you know swing the wings back. You just have to adjust it correctly, else the pack here would uh, will actually break. You can see here. Okay, it might snap, so you have to be very careful. So I do get some uh, stress mark here. So you have to Right, I think that part is the uh, the, the only weakness. Uh, other than that, I, I think it's it's excellent. Okay, beautiful. Um, it really looks like the vulture, and the wings is just beautiful. Okay, yeah. So that's the review of uh, no AKOF brand uh, vulture minifigure. Uh, excellent. Uh, I haven't seen this in a long time. This kind of minifigure. Beautiful, uh, fun to play with, uh, superb details. Okay, so they have it. So this is the Vulture minifigure, and hope you enjoyed this video. And uh, I'll see you again soon in my next video. Bye bye now.